Hello folks, welcome to Amy's rant number one. Now you're probably wondering what am I going to rant about today? Well, I'll tell you. I'm going to rant about live journal communities and online message boards, specifically the Colbert Nation message board. Now let me share something first of all about a live journal community that I belong to. It is for the Colbert Report TV show. Now, in this particular live journal community, a common thread is always posted at the time that a show is on, on TV. Now, I live on the West Coast, so unfortunately I can't comment along with the people in the thread. But, you know, I try to avoid reading it for spoilers, whatever. The point is that the majority of the people who post in these threads are fangirls. And these girls fixate on one thing in particular, Steven's ties, okay? There are many things about this show to love. You know, the, the political commentary, the satire, the humor. Okay? And they fixate on the man's ties! What is with ties? Okay? I don't get it! There's so much more to the show than that! And, and, and they're thinking about ties! You know, it's ridiculous! And these girls, they give a bad name to all the rest of us fans. Okay? That's what really grates my cheese, you know? Okay? Because I met Stephen Colbert last month. Okay? I went to a taping. I was lucky enough. And I stayed after, and I got to meet him, and I posted about my experience in this community. Now, I went to a taping of the Colbert Report last month. I was fortunate enough to be able to get a ticket and go. And I met Stephen afterwards, which was even luckier. And when I came back from meeting him, I posted my story on this message board, you know. And now all these girls have gotten tickets to go, and I think they're all going to try to meet him afterwards. And I feel bad because I started this trend, and, you know, they just want to meet him because they're, they're squealing fangirls. Not all of them are like this, mind you, but there are many that are. And, you know, when I met him, there was real meaning behind it. I took something away from meeting him that I didn't even know I was going to take away, you know. And it just freaking gets to me that these girls are, you know, going to go taint the sanctity of such an experience. But anyway... You know, and then there's the, the Colbert Nation message board, which I mentioned previously, okay? And on this board, you got some real crazy, some real wackadoos who, you know, are just creepy. Okay, there's this one chick. Her net handle is Steven the Lover, okay? And then that's creepy enough, all right? But then she's got a link to her MySpace page, okay? And you go to her page, and the whole thing is freaking stalkerazzi, fatal attraction, you know type thing. It's really creepy. I mean, it's like she's got this whole bizarre idea that she's, you know, Steven's lover, you know. And it's like, these people are freaking creepy. I don't want them in my fandom. No, thank you. Don't pollute my fandom, you know. I mean, I, I mean it's just, you know, cut it out. So you get my point. You understand what I'm trying to say here, right? That, that, that there's always a few crazy people who just ruin good fan communities for the rest of us. And that's just the thing that I don't want, you know? Ugh. Well, that's all for Amy's rant number one. Sorry for the technical difficulties, folks. I'm still new at this film editing thing, so uh, it's been a little shaky, but, you know, I think we made it through all right. And uh, if you all leave me some good feedback, but I want you to be honest. If you like this rant, say so. If you didn't, tell me. And then we'll see about maybe doing Amy's rant number two. All right, folks. Thank you for watching.